Hi, Peter Rice, please. Uh, could you tell him it's urgent? It's the uh, call. He was expecting the call right around now. Just tell him it's the call. Yes, this is Peter. Hey, it, it, it's me. I'm, uh, I, I'm driving up to Buellton. I'm almost there. Uh, you know, you told me to check in. You got the videotape rolling, yeah? Yeah, no, I'm actually holding the camera. Like, believe me, you'll, you'll have proof that I was here. Okay, now, let's just be clear. You know what it is you're up there to do, right? Well, I know what it is I'm doing. It's just you really haven't explained why. I'm going to spell it out for you. This is the most expensive movie Fox Searchlight have ever financed. Right. And we are getting production reports of these guys shooting six or seven hour days. Yeah. So I want to know what they're doing with the rest of that time and our money. We're hearing stories of these guys drinking real wine on the set. Now, I know it's a wine movie, but, you know, these guys basically are having way too much fun, and I want to know what's going on. I want you to take that camera. I want you to go to speak to each of the department heads, take as much tape as you can, and just try and get to the bottom of it and report back to me. Okay, I got it. Thank you. You can trust me with this. Okay. Okay, bye-bye. And here we are. Hey, excuse me. I'm Hi. looking for the uh, sideways production office. You found it. Yeah, right in there. Right over there. You guys uh, on a break? Break? Yeah, yeah we're on a break. Yeah, right. good. Yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay. Hi. Oh, hey, man. Are you with the band? Um, Are you no. Here for the Which band? The poison? The poison? No. Hey, check it out, man. Gary Edelman, our transportation uh, coordinator, is uh, good friends with Brett Michaels, so uh, Poison's going to be playing at the uh, production office tonight. Wait, I was looking for the Sideways production office, actually. The movie? Oh, yeah, yeah. You mean Camp Sideways. You know, we celebrate uh, every time we get a chance. Day so all of these, all of, all of these are, these are actual, all Little actually parties party. that you had? Yeah, oh, yeah, yeah. Like, the, the actors uh, actually threw a party. Yeah, they did, and they, they really like beer, beans, and weed, and uh, so does everyone else here at the production office. Uh, we took a week off uh, to train for our uh, art department versus production team. I thought, there was a, I thought it was a big storm, actually, that hit off. Uh, you know, storm, training, it's not really... Uh, it's not really important. Well, this is you know? this looks like an actual call sheet up here, though. Uh, yeah, we do try to get in a couple hours of work every day. Uh, today we're doing an eighth of a page over at the windmill. Huh. That's great, Brian. Thank you very much. Oh, you're welcome. And this is obviously the... I don't hear the phone. Are these guys working, actually? No, you know, we actually have the uh, phones uh, forwarded to uh, Michael London's office in L.A. Hi, I'm looking for Mr. Parra. Oh, yeah. Um, he's on set. What is... Uh, I'm a little confused. What's all this... Uh, we have some great stuff here. A lot of merchandise here. Yeah, look at these. These are sideways glasses, usually $19.99, but I'll sell them to you for $12.95. Excuse me. Yeah. Who are you? Um, like, can I help you with something? Yeah, I'm shooting a little behind the scenes footage, kind of like EPK. You know what? Nobody called, nobody. No, I don't uh, know EP, we have a, in our, we're allowed to do EPK anytime we want, actually. Peter Rice at Fox is asking me to come up and look around. I'm sure there's no real cause for concern, but there were some issues that have come up, sort of cost overrun issues, budgeting you know issues. I don't think you need to be concerned. Shooting because... time, parties, etc. Uh, they've been a little concerned about the director and sort of the director. The we understand the movie's about drinking, but well, everything's and, really great here. Everything's fine. I, I wouldn't worry about it. Can we talk a little bit about the money then? We just we just go over some of the you know accounting what, that's issues. That's not my that area. I don't really. We go to production I manager. Yeah, but I don't deal with that. That's really yeah. not my bag. Well, who does deal with that? Um, the accounting department. Maybe you should see Marsha. So so this is Marsha. This is Marsha. Hi. This is our production Hi. accountant. And Marsha, the... come up from the studio. I'm just shooting some behind the scenes footage. And, Hi. Uh, how are those you? Those are questions we had, and Ginger thought maybe you were the right person to ask. Well, you know what? It'd be great actually if we could all sit down and talk about this stuff together. Yeah, I really anything don't... you want to know, I can tell you. Right, sure. tell you. So I'm out of here. Just, okay. I'd like to talk to you later, maybe if I could. Uh, so just... Yeah, I'll be in my office. Have a seat. Have a seat. Thanks. Well, uh, basically, there seemed to be some questions about um, about scheduling and money. The fact that right. they're working four or five, six-hour days, which Normal, uh, normal you know, shooting schedule, 12, it's 13. True. It's true. Normal, you know, we're used to 13-hour days. And we budgeted. We did, we budgeted. Did. Maybe no, you could just budgeted. show me where them, I mean. Well, this. sure, you can look here. Actually, that's not it. Let me um, pull up. Um, that was here. just something that I was looking at for before. But. I just need to figure out where the money's actually well, going. The money is actually going to the movie. Honestly, I know it seems strange. I really do, but I think maybe the best thing for you to do is is to, you know, look in the art department. What's going on in the art department? Well, I think that Alexander, you know, there's a scene in the movie, um, the underworld, it's, it's not very, you know, it's an eighth of the page. Yeah. You know? But he wants to, um, maybe he's stuck, you know, 
he wants to put more in this money. And his idea when I talked to him is that everything, save as much as you can, all the savings, it's got to go here. You know, I think that you should go to the art department and you should talk with Jane and see. That sounds like a really good idea. I think you should. No, I really appreciate here. your, I appreciate you know your help. Before you go, no, I should probably go. before you go, yeah. I think, you know, maybe you should have, you know, a glass of wine to put you in the mood. A glass of wine? Okay. Too bad. I'm really you tempted, but I appreciate it. You sure? Yeah. I can, well, look, I'm going I'm to go. I'll come back after okay. the, yeah. Okay. Thank you very much. Yeah. Walking into the, uh, well, here's the art department. I'm hopefully going to find uh, production designer James Stewart. Oh my God, that is a lot of bottles of wine. And that is really freaky. It's like some strange seance thing. Huh. Excuse me. Yeah, hi. I'm looking for James Stewart. Uh, Jane Stewart. I'm looking for uh, the production, the Sideways production. Uh, sideways production. Yeah. Right. And you are? Um, just tell her I'm with the studio. The studio. Uh, <clears throat> Excuse me. Why don't you, uh, I'm looking for uh, Jane Stewart, the production designer. Yeah. Marcia Swinton told me that I might want to, uh, might want to talk to you about some of the cost issues and some of the overruns that are going on. Oh well, we we spent all the money that uh, we we could on the on the movie. Well, let me be honest. What what Marcia said was that a million five hundred thousand dollars has gone into this little underworld debacle. Does that sound right? I would no. call it debacle. Yes. No, it was I, way less than that. Add it up. I, That's a six seven hundred dollar bottle of wine, isn't it? Uh, no maybe way. it's. I think it's empty. No, 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 um, no, 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 no. We haven't been. I think I have the desk one point in the wrong place. Mm, okay. I'll, I'll revise it. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Listen, you guys, I got to get on the set. Listen, you guys, uh, can you explain what's going on to... Uh, yeah. Sure, sure. Uh, yeah. I, I, I'll be right back. Uh, you guys are going to have to explain this to me. What's all the underworld stuff? Uh, yeah. yeah. I'm sorry, who, what's your name? Uh, Tim. You guys worked on movies before, any of you? <clears throat> yes. Yeah. Yeah. Hi, can I speak to Peter Rice? No, 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 it's me again. I, I have to talk to him now. Can you get him out of the meeting? Hey, it's me. Uh, no, I've, I, I've been to the production office, I've been to the art department, and it's, it's pretty bad. Now? I'm going, look, I'm going over to the director's house. I'm driving to his house. What more do you want me to do? No, I don't, I don't think he's going Coppola, but I, I, I can't find him. That's part of the problem. I really don't know where he is. You know, they're shooting today, but the, the call time isn't until 2 p.m. And, and then they're supposed to be wrapping at 8 p.m., according to the call sheet. All right, I'll call you back. Thanks. All right, I'm 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 entering. I believe this is the. Uh... Oh my god. Uh, this is definitely supposed to be the director's uh, the director's home. The director's home with with his wife is actually a co-star of the movie. And oh my god, this is just this is revolting. This is really a little freaky. This looks like. Look at all that Dinty Moore. No, I'm Kevin. I don't know. I, did you see that footage? I, 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 I don't even know what kind of footage he's getting. I don't know where he's been. <laughs> so I'm sorry. Oh, uh, uh, I'm sorry. What? Mr. Payne? Alexander around? You're Sandra. You're Sandra. I work at Fox. I'm sorry. I, I... Fox is here. I don't know what the fuck to do. Fox is here. Okay, okay fine. Oh, hi. No, no, I, I'm, I'm, I just... Is, there, is Alexander okay? I'm just supposed to be sending a report back to Fox. No, um, I, I couldn't. I couldn't find the director, and they, they gave me the address. Um, I, uh, everything everything's okay fine. Um, uh, Alexander is. Um, you got. You guys. Sleep, you sleep back here. Does um, Alexander sleep back here? No. Um, actually, Alexander sleeps in that room. Oh, okay. I got it. I got it. Yeah. Look, if, if it's a bad moment, I, no, it's honestly, not a bad I mean, moment at all. Um, I, 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 um, I'm sure Alexander's not on. Uh, he's on set, isn't he? We just had a, a, just a little get together. The the DP and the and the AD were over, and they were just discussing oh um, some stuff. Can I can I um can I get you anything? I um would you like some uh, wine? Uh, it's. It's, um, Could you maybe call your husband and let him know that Peter Rice sent someone up here, sort of just looking in on things? Oh, you're and from Peter Rice. Yeah, I mean, I'm I'm going back to LA with with this tape and this. Oh, you know, well, you I, know what? He's all he's all, he's a location scouting right now. And, no, no, wait, wait, um, and I right now, to, can I just and, look a little more? Oh, uh, yeah, actually, and and uh, he, he should be back. Thank you, thank you. I'm checking out my call sheet here at the 
According to this, there's a gathering of department heads two hour before call time. The DP's house, Faden and Papa Michael. Looks like the first place I'm gonna really have a chance to track people down. Hopefully Faden, maybe the producer. If I get lucky, maybe even find Alec.